The American Outdoor Track and Field Championship is set for Friday through Sunday in Wichita, Kansas, where teams will compete to take home the conference hardware. The American welcomes back 21 champions to defend individual titles and numerous all-conference athletes from around the league. Of the 21 returning champions, 10 have won multiple gold medals at the Outdoor Championship. The Houston men are one of the clear favorites as they have been led by a core group of senior sprinters this year. They have been one of the top teams in the country all season, cracking the nation's top five after finishing as this year's NCAA Indoor National Runner-Up. This group includes five-time individual outdoor hurdles champion Amir Latin, this year's American Indoor Most Valuable Performer, Mario Burke and NCAA First Team All-Americans Kamari Montgomery, Trumaine Jefferson, and John Lewis III. Combined, the Cougs have accounted for 13 top 20 marks in the NCAA this outdoor season. For the men, Houston leads the conference and ranks top five in the country in every sprinting event heading into this championship. The Cougars are coming off three straight American outdoor titles and have won in four of the last five years. UConn and Memphis have finished in the top five in every American Outdoor Championship. The Huskies are the only other team to take home the men's title, winning in 2015. For UConn, keep an eye on returning two-time champion thrower Cameron Thompson, who set the conference's hammer throw record with his distance of 63.19 meters after successfully defending his title in 2018. Wichita State could make some noise as well at home in its inaugural Outdoor American Championship, the Shockers earned several trips to the podium and led for portions of the meet, ending the day in third place with 130 points. Austin Corley stunned two-time defending 400-meter hurdles champion Amari Latin with his meet record performance of 50.07 seconds, which catapulted him into the nation's top 10 after entering the meet ranked 38th. Corley returns to defend his title this year. Javelin thrower Aaron True has been another top athlete for the Shockers. Last year, True set the meet record with a distance of 77.49 meters. Returning as a senior, True has been one of the best javelin throwers in the country, ranking in the nation's top five this season. On the women's side, Houston will also look to defend their title from a year ago. Last year, the Cougs won their first ever outdoor track and field title in the American. They then carried that success into the indoor season, joining the men in sweeping the American titles. Starting the final day of last year's outdoor championships in fourth place, the Houston women used five first place track performances and won gold in a field event to propel to the top of the team rankings. Among seven returning all-conference athletes, junior Breanne Bethel will return after winning the conference's Women's Most Valuable Outdoor Performance last season. She won gold in both the 100 and 200 meter dashes and ran as part of the Cougars' first place relay teams. However, Bethel will be challenged in her course sprinting events by SMU's Chelsea Francis, who leads the conference in the 100 and 200. Last year, the ECU women recorded its best finish in meet history as well, taking second place while Cincinnati rounded out the top three. A few other notable performers to keep an eye on. After redshirting during the outdoor season last year, the American welcomes back one of its most decorated field athletes in Cincinnati's All-America thrower, Annette Echikunwoke. The Ohio native is a three-time American outdoor champion, winning the hammer throw in 2016 and 17, and the shot put as well in 2017. Once again, Echikunwoke has made a splash on the Americans' performance list with top 20 distances in the nation in both the hammer and shot put to lead the conference this year. Memphis's Ashley Pryke won the past two women's javelin titles, setting the Americans' record in 17 with her distance of 55.18 meters. The senior All-American finished seventh at the NCAA Championships last year. For Wichita State, distance runner Rebecca Tofum earned the most points in the meet at the Indoor Championship to claim the conference's Most Valuable Performance Award. Tofum won the mile and 3,000 meter run while also running the anchor leg of Wichita State's first place distance medley relay team. In addition to winning the 2018 cross country title, Winnie Koskai turned in some of the most impressive performances at last year's outdoor meet. Koskai won both the 5,000 and 10,000 meter championships, defeating then frontrunner Hannah Miller of SMU. 
It'll be a distance battle on the track once again as Miller and Coast Sky hold the top two 5,000 and 10,000 meter times in the American, respectively. You can tune in to all three days of live coverage on the American Digital Network Plus on Facebook. Also, for results, head to Championship Central at theamerican.org slash OTF.